welcome back to our channel. My name is Rosie. Today we are making yogurt. Yay! I'll show you how to make yogurt from scratch. We actually need yogurt to make yogurt. You just need a little bit of yogurt to make actual yogurt. So let me show you. Here are the ingredients that we will be using. This is our plain yogurt. We like using plain yogurt. We have honey to sweeten the yogurt. We have milk. You like this milk and you can use whichever extract you like we are using French vanilla extract so why do we need yogurt to make yogurt because we need the live and active cultures in the yogurt to make the yogurt that we want because that will convert pasteurized milk to yogurt during fermentation so the warm milk will create a very perfect environment for the bacteria to grow which will thicken the milk and create yogurt so let's go I'm making three cups okay pour your milk into your pot and let it boil and as it boils stir it slowly warming up as the milk boils I have a glass bowl that I will be using to put the milk in to create the yogurt and I also have my towels here that I will use to cover the bowl so that I create that warm environment for the yogurt so our milk has come to a boil and we turn off the heat and remove it off so now you let it cool you must make sure that it's cooled down to the point where you can actually Put your pinky in and have it not burn. Wash your hands so that you should be able to hold your pinky in there for about six to seven seconds without it burning. Then you know that your milk is ready for you to put your stutter. Okay, so our milk is cooled down to the point where we want it. Let's feel that. Okay, milk is ready for you to put your stutter yogurt cultures in there. I measured three cups of milk, so I'm going to use three heaping tablespoons of yogurt because I want it nice and thick. I'm using a whisk now to make sure that I get rid of all the chunks because I want the milk to be super smooth. And then at this point, because I want a vanilla yogurt, so I'm going to use French vanilla extract is what I'm using because I'm going for vanilla yogurt. So I'm measuring just a few drops, about three drops. That's all you need. This is natural honey that I'll use. I'll also do three tablespoons. Three, three, three. And that should be good. I'll stir it again. Just to make sure that it's all mixed nicely. Good is I'll cover it. And then I have my clothes here clean kitchen clothes that I use. I want to make sure that it's nice and warm. The environment around it. Tie that. Make sure that the bowl is covered completely. Tie it again. And one more time. And then I'll put a big yogurt towel around it to ensure that all the warmth stays in there just like that there now your yogurt is perfectly covered now do not disturb it i will leave it overnight and i'll check it tomorrow and we'll see you can leave it for about six to seven hours it will work but it's always good to make it overnight and then check it the following day so you can put it in your oven, just remember not to turn the oven on. 
or on top of the fridge which is where I will put mine on top of the fridge. We will check this again tomorrow. Thank you! Hi guys, welcome back. This is our yogurt that we made yesterday. I have to say that we've been out all day and so it's been in the on top of the fridge all night all day it's now almost quarter to nine and this is when we are getting home so we figured let's just reveal it and see what it looks like voila it's the yogurt you can see it's nice and thick this is what you want I'm going to put it in this mason jar and put it in the fridge and then I'll put just a little bit in the freezer. It will be my starter for the next time that I make yogurt. Thank you for joining us. Bye.